Hi, Brockton residents. It's Friday, uh, July 9th. I hope you're all doing well. It's Mayor Robert Sullivan here at City Hall. I wanted to just kind of give you an update on, on what's going on. Uh, of course, uh, my thoughts and prayers are with the nation of Haiti and all our great um, Haitian residents here in the City of Champions with the assassination of President Moise. Um, in terms of um, what we've done, we've been able to, to reach out um, to the Haitian community here on the local level. And again, uh, I'm just uh, so saddened by those actions in Haiti. So um, I hope that um, solidarity with Haiti consists and that um, the civil unrest um, subsides. And again, uh, anything that I can do on the local level as mayor, I will not hesitate to do. Um, also just wanted to thank the Brockton Police Department, the state police and the FBI. As you know, we had a bank robbery this week here in the city of Brockton, Santander on Torrey Street. Uh, and it could have been a really, really, really bad situation, but through the expertise and the professionalism, the two suspects were apprehended. Um, I want to thank the canine units and all of the, uh, the men and women that protect and serve, and those two individuals will be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. I um, also want to announce that um, Brady Winston started in my office today. Brady, she's uh, uh, a new resident, the city of Brockton. She already rented a place here. She's our intergovernment affairs and public policy uh, liaison here and associate, and I'm really excited. Uh, she's just relocated from the city uh, of Seattle uh, to the city of Champions, so that's great. And uh, she'll be working uh, with our elected officials on the local level, state level, and federal level. Um, also, just to vaccine update, we're at almost 55%. We're at 54.5% of residents here in the city of Brockton have been vaccinated. Now, also remember, there is a high percentage of folks that cannot get the vaccine because they haven't met the age qualification. They're under 12. So um, we're doing well. We're going to continue uh, our vaccine clinics every Thursday, uh, the Board of Health is doing it at the Cape Verdean Association on Montello Street, North Montello Street. Every Saturday, uh, Board of Health is doing it at the Shaw Center from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Every Thursday, Neighborhood Health Center with the National Guard is conducting a clinic again at the Shaw Center. And we're doing a lot of the pop-up clinics around the city of Brockton, Market Basket, Vincentes, the Westgate Mall. We're doing a lot, and that's with our DPH friends as well. So um, Yankee Line, which is the bus we go around. So again, you can always call the mayor's office, 508-580-7123. Uh, we are um, doing um, this weekend, let me see, clinics, uh, Market Basket, um, Saturday tomorrow from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. at the Westgate Mall at Market Basket. On Sunday, uh, 8.30 to 1.30 at St. Patrick's Roman Catholic Church on Main Street next to the Council on Aging. Um, and then we're going to continue to just do that throughout the summer months. Um, also, just want to take a moment um, to thank two public servants, um, Larry Rowley, DPW commissioner recently retired, worked for the city of Brockton over 40 years. He's just a really, really great professional, great guy. I wish Larry all the best in his retirement. And then our city clerk, Mr. Anthony Zioli, over 30 years working here for the city of Brockton as the city clerk. And I wish Tony all the best in his retirement as well. So um, listen, it's an honor, privilege to serve as the mayor of Brockton. We are always better together. We need to continue to work in a collaborative manner. Uh, we are working as diligently as we can, attracting new businesses, helping our businesses here, making sure that investment is rolling in here. Uh, and I did just meet with the uh, Brockton Beer Company principals the other day, and it looks like they're going to be opening them the first brew pub downtown. Now it looks like it's going to be, uh, you know, October 1st or so. So this is good. Good things are happening in the Brockton uh, area. So be well. Enjoy your weekend. I'll be back again to give you an update. Thank you.